Okay, so the instructions for this assignment are on the first slide and you are to create your artwork on the second. I've got a big example of my drawing on the third page and a, a video. I'm going to go ahead and show you how I did this. I'm going to start by inserting a shape, a shape, and I'm going to choose the rectangle. I'm going to go ahead and draw the rectangle in the background. This is going to be my sky. Right here is the fill color. I'm going to use the gradient. And that's my sky color. I'm going to insert. I can use this right here for the shape as well. Either one you can do to insert your shapes. And I'm going to change the color here to the green. And now I have, I need to insert a picture. And I'm going to insert an image, search the web. I'm going to do truck clip art, no background. And I'm just going to choose one that I see here that is a good sideways drawing. I'm going to take this one and go ahead and insert it. And I'm going to make it face the other direction. Oh, I want to insert my trees first, actually. I'm going to look for trees. Art, no background. And here I've got some trees. I'm going to go ahead and insert a tree. And I'm going to size it down to be, so it will be behind my truck. And I'll go ahead and insert another one. I can just copy this. And paste it. And now I have two trees. Okay, and now I'm going to look for truck art. Truck art, no background. Yeah, that looks like a good one. I'm going to go ahead and put this on there. And I'm going to reduce it down. And I'm just going to flip it over so it's going in the other direction. Now this is um, a truck for some food. And I'm going to turn it into a or truck. It's carrying a load of pumpkins. I'm going to go ahead and turn it into a food truck by inserting a shape right over the back there. And I'm going to change the color of that shape to be a brown color. Each time I do this, it's a little bit different, which is OK. Uh, I got a slightly different car here. I don't know if I can change the color to that, but we'll stick with it like that. Maybe I'll change the background color here a little bit so it's a little bit lighter. Okay, so next I'm going to insert a, another rectangle for my window. And that's the selling window. And now I'm going to search for the web for uh, food, art, no background. So I can put some food on my truck. There's something I can put on there. And I'm going to reduce it down. Whenever your, your blue squares are there, you can reduce it down to fit the size that you want it. And I accidentally reduced this one, so I'm going to go back up a little bit bigger. And so this food truck is going to have some hamburgers in it. And food truck art, food truck art, no background, food art. There's some more trucks there, but let's see if I could just get, there we go. How about hot dogs? 
and I'm going to reduce it down. This is just showing you what tabs I'm using to actually create the image. This has got to be a little bit bigger so I can actually have a person inside there. So this is going to be a hot dog and a hamburger food truck. And I'm going to um, search for some anime anime people. And let's see what I could find here. Of course, I can never seem to find the exact same ones. Anime No Background. And here's my food seller guy. I'm going to go ahead and put him in the window to be the guy who's selling the food. And lastly, I want some people to buy, and I'm going to set these two kids there. They are going to be my customers. So there you have my food truck with some customers. Now somehow I lost one of my trees, so I'm going to copy that and paste it in there again. And now this is the inst interesting problem. The tree is in front of the truck, so I'm going to go ahead and use the arrange order and send backward. And I'm going to have to do it about five times or more to get it to be behind the truck because every shape is a layer, and it, there's probably going to have to do it ten times. There we go. It's, it's finally moving back. Send backwards. And now I have it behind the truck. So there is my food truck. I can move him over a little bit more and this down a little bit more so we can see more of the tree. I'll move this fella over. Oh, I don't want to do that. So you see, whatever the blue squares are uh, on, that's the shape you're actually going to move. And um, there's my people. There's my food truck and my people. And so that's this one. I have another one if you uh, want to just see the build on the next slide. I do have a, a uh, an animation on the next slide that is a video of my other food truck. With the, with the things that I actually have on it. So there's my this food truck. This is the first one I built. I can't seem to find that car again. And now here is the animation for that one, and you can see it actually being built really quickly here. I have two trees. My truck comes in. I put my rectangles on there, my pizza, my various food, and my anime. So that's the animation of it. So thank you very much.